Good evening, everyone, and a very, very warm welcome to the EE BAFTA Film Awards 2024. I'm Sarah Putt, the chair of BAFTA, and it is my absolute pleasure to introduce tonight's ceremony. BAFTA is an independent arts charity and an academy with a membership of 12,000 creatives working across film, games and television. We're here to champion talent, exceptional storytelling, and to help make the screen industries a more equitable and sustainable place. We couldn't do this without your support. On that note, I'm honored to welcome BAFTA's president, His Royal Highness, the Prince of Wales. Thank you. Thank you for being here tonight and for all your support in helping BAFTA to deliver its mission. May I take this moment to send Her Royal Highness the Princess of Wales and His Majesty the King our very best wishes. <clears throat> when writing this speech, I wanted to reflect on the past 12 months Words seem somehow inadequate. It's been a year of immense challenge for our industry and for the world. And yet a year in which films provided distraction, joy, delight, and commentary on who we are as humans in all our complexities. A year of stellar storytelling. The caliber of filmmaking represented in the nominated films this year is outstanding. It has definitely been the most talked about awards season in years. Yes, I'm calling it. Turbo boosted by Barbenheimer, audiences rediscovered cinema, seeking out the talked about films and discovering some lesser known gems. The creative force of the British film industry is proudly on display tonight. We are a sector with a skilled workforce in the hundreds of thousands, a production spend in the billions, and one of the biggest filming locations by studio space in the whole world. Yet, according to a recent survey, while more than half of British school leavers are interested in a career in film and TV, fewer than one in five of them considers this a realistic option. What a huge waste of potential talent. For too many people, the film industry still seems like an impregnable fortress. All of us here tonight can help to change that. At BAFTA, we work constantly to remove barriers. We provide access, community, mentorship and financial support to talented people in front of and behind the camera. Our aspiration to level the playing field is a journey that BAFTA and the whole industry is on, and there is still a long way to go. Awards are just as important. Awards can show that our industry is truly welcoming of all voices and all stories. Awards can inspire a belief that a career in our brilliant industry is really possible. And awards can simply be about sharing our love of cinema, inviting audiences to celebrate with us the bold and brave stories that help us to understand the world and each other a little better. That is our industry's soft power. That is our superpower. I can't close without thanking the folk who make this magical evening happen. To Jane Millerchip, our amazing CEO and the whole BAFTA team, the wonderful Anna Higgs, chair of the film committee, and all of the film committee who volunteer their time and industry expertise so generously to BAFTA. Also, a big shout out to our fabulous partners, including EE, the BBC, and co-producers Penny Lane. And of course, tonight's host, the incomparable David Tennant. Last, but not least, to all of our nominees. To be nominated by your industry peers, particularly in such a competitive and extraordinary year, 
is a truly impressive feat. This is your night. We are here to showcase your work, your talent, your stories. We hope you all have an amazing evening. Thank you.